It truly is a brotherhood. Every night that we're together, it's a fellowship. Even when we're not in those quote unquote Bible study times, it is a fellowship. Those guys are holding me accountable off the field. I, I'm holding them accountable as well. Um, so we truly care about each other. We truly care about the growth that each individual has in the word as believers as well, and but as friends and family as well. Trey, Ghost, Carson, Hicks. There's a lot of guys that are really trying to boost me up along the way, kind of keep me focused on the main thing, which is obviously the Word and Jesus. I think everyone's kind of building that foundation so you're never pushed too far where you're able to be destroyed. I mean, I think all those guys have found joy throughout this process, whereas if they weren't able to find that joy, they'd probably be in a really depressed state. And I just think it goes back to that fellowship too, where we're able to not only help keep them positive, but also build them up so they're not trying to do this by themselves either. Being a Christian athlete, uh, I wouldn't trade it for the world. Obviously, it saved my life. I think being on a team like this, there's a lot of believers and guys that have been able to help me along the way. Two years ago, I was a completely different person. I would go up and down with how my football performance was, whereas now I'm kind of just even keeled and I don't think it's a coincidence that my mindset of being this way um, and my faith has led to probably my best year that I've had in the NFL. So I think just having that courage, having those guys encourage me, being able to go out there and kind of preach the word. And anytime we get, I think uh, it's an honor to be able to do that at this in this platform. It takes a lot of courage. In college, you know, everyone's saying it's not cool to do this, it's not cool to do that, but about my priority, my priority is to glorify God each and every day, each and every situation. That's the one thing I've been called to do. If you're able to do that, you're not gonna have any regrets down the road. I think it's courageous that people, are, when they're able to go through that college environment and kind of stay strong and maintain that foundation of God and Christ, and, it's a powerful thing and my hat's off to them. Um, I wish I knew Jesus in my walk a lot earlier. I encourage everyone to go into the Word and kind of learn about Jesus and how amazing He is. He changed my life and uh, I'm encouraging you guys to do the same.